how to find which products have had the Amazon's choice batch. Uh, why is this important? How can it make you money? A lot of uh, buyers out there sometimes base their purchase off of Amazon's choice. So by seeing who's got Amazon's choice for certain keywords, you kind of know who might be dominating in that niche and, and who might be the the uh, sellers that you need to really go after and which keywords are certain sellers really dominating on. So it's very easy uh, the way to do that. I did a search here for collagen peptides. Now here in the search results, uh, there's an Amazon's choice button and the first filter says analyze product. If I select that, I'm going to show all of the keywords where the last time Helium 10 checked, this product had the Amazon's choice. Now the way you can kind of differentiate that in Cerebro is if this little Amazon logo here is fully colored black, white, and orange. That means that the last time Helium 10 checked, this product had Amazon's choice, all right? Here is how Amazon's choice looks. Now, sometimes in the past, it would say actually Amazon's choice. Right now, at the time I'm making this video, it actually says overall pick. Maybe you guys have seen that. But as you can see right now, this uh, collagen peptides that I ran Cerebro on has the overall pick and that's what it shows in Cerebro. It doesn't always match though, because again, this might have been done seven days ago or three days ago, and maybe today or in my browser, it might be a little different, but a lot of the times it's going to be the same. Now, if I were to select under Amazon's choice drop down filter here, uh, other product, that means that the last time Helium 10 checked, there was an Amazon's choice for this a keyword, but it was not this product that I'm that I'm looking for. And then the last option here is no badges. And what that means are these are the keywords where the last time Helium 10 check, nobody in the search results had Amazon's choice. So all three of these things, there's different reasons why you might want to search for each one of them. If you're looking at what, uh, one of your competitors and you notice they've got Amazon's choice for almost every keyword, you know, that's going to be a tough a tough competitor to uh, compete against. Uh, another thing is maybe you find a whole bunch of keywords that had some decent search volume, but the last time Helium 10 check, nobody had Amazon's choice. Who knows? Maybe those are keywords that you could potentially be the one to get uh, Amazon's choice on. So there's a lot of different ways that you can use that uh, method. <laughs>